Okay, welcome back to Scorecast, the next Jack away, I'm on my own because Tim's off coaching some Paralympic champions or something, but you're in safe hands because I am the head of human flags here at Scorecast, the next. And the tutorial I've got for you today is five easy steps to the human flag. Okay, step one for the human flag is we need to make sure that we have got the movement capability in our shoulders to make this overhead position. It's just that in the human flag you're going to be sideways. So, for that I'm going to use um, one of these bands and it is called an overhead rotation. So, I'm grabbing it, shoulder, uh, outside shoulder width apart, trying to keep my little pinkies on the side of the band if I can. The better you are at this, the narrower you can take it. The good thing about the band, when you go over the top, you can stretch it apart if you're a little bit tight and then it's going to pull you back round trying to keep a nice control of my shoulders and I'm imagining I'm pinching a pound coin between my shoulder blades as I come back over. What we don't want to do is if we're really tight and we get to the top and we run out of range in the shoulder is we'll arch our backs to try and get ourselves around. We don't want to do that because all that's doing is giving us a false sense of what range we've got of the shoulder and it's not going to keep us in a good position when we go eventually into our human flag. Okay, step two is looking at the pulling arm in our human flag and we're looking at a single arm active hang where I'm going to try and get uh, some separation between my ear and my shoulder. So I'm going to jump up onto the bar, I'm going to be on one side and I'm going to try and pull my shoulder blade down behind and you see that separation created by, between my ear and my shoulder. Super important that I'm pulling straight, I'm not pulling with the biceps, so the arm is straight and that is going to be my top arm in the human flag. Okay, so that might be a little bit too difficult when we're just starting out. So we're going to get out our assistance tool from the locker, which is one of these resistance bands, and it's going to help support you slightly. So I'm going to chuck it over the top. I'm going to then loop it through, pull it down. Obviously, the more help you want, the stronger the band. And then I'm going to put both feet in and then jump up to grab the bar. I recommend grabbing it with two to start with. And then what you're going to do is you're then going to take that hand off and hold the band. And you can support yourself a little bit if you need to. And then I'm going to work to create that separation between my shoulder and my ear. And the band is just helping pulling you up slightly. But it gives you the chance to feel what it's like to pull with that single arm active hang. Okay, step three is linking this single arm active hang that we did in step two with an oblique pull to try and get some horizontal movement where I'm trying to get this hip up towards this active hang of the shoulder and that's going to come from pulling with my obliques. So it starts the same point as step two where I'm single arm hanging and then I go active so pull that shoulder down, create that separation from the ear and then I'm squeezing the obliques to pull this hip up towards the shoulder and you notice that the feet go up and out to the side. So do it again, active hang, create that separation, then pull the obliques, pull the hip and legs up out to the side, starting to create some of that horizontal movement that's going to help keep me out in that human flag by connecting my straight arm active hang with that oblique pull to keep those hips up. Just like with the single arm active hang, if that's starting to be a little bit difficult when you're just starting out, then we can grab our band and it's going to give us a little bit of assistance, just exactly the same. So again, band goes over the top, loop through, pull it down, both feet go in it, I jump up, I'm going to hold it, I then go active, and then again squeeze in out to the side. You can see you can get an awful lot more movement with the band helping out. So active hang, squeeze those obliques out to the side, legs start to come up. Okay, so step four is where we bring in the pushing arm, which is the bottom arm of that in that human flag. And this we're going to now connect the single arm active hang with that oblique pull, as well as pushing with that bottom arm and that's going to start to create some of that torque and that leverage to get me to a more uh, horizontal position but what we're going to do on the bars is I'm going to be out at a 45 degree angle making it way more easy when you're out at an angle rather than fully out parallel to the floor the forces involved are way less but it gives the brain the chance to learn all those three things happening at once the pull the push and the oblique pull so I'm going to start with step two I go active create that separation and then I'm going to start to as I push out with this bottom arm, I'm going to squeeze those obliques and I'm going to try and hold myself up 
at that 45 degree angle, I can come back down, I can go active, squeeze the obliques, push it out with that bottom arm, giving my brain the chance to learn what it's like to pull, push and squeeze those obliques out but not at that fully horizontal position. So I give myself an easier exercise where the brain's gonna learn those three things, which is quite complex, in a safer, easier environment. Okay, so step five is gonna be um, fully into the flag position where I'm gonna be pushing my bottom arm, pulling with the top and getting those obliques up, but with the added assistance of using our special friend, the resistance band going to stick only the top foot in this time which is different rather than putting both in and I'm going to step away I'm going to grab the top arm it's going to be pulling the bottom arm is going to be pushing and I step away and let that band pull that top leg up and then I'm going to get nice and set until I can feel like I'm pulling those legs together Ooh. and holding my human flag they're all day with the band. <laughs>